Hi, this is Mike. Today I'm going to give you a quick overview. Uh, we're getting ready to do an install of a Prins vapor injected propane system on a 2013 F-150 with a 5.0. The Prins system uh, is a universal kit that you can uh, install on just about any vehicle. Uh, ranging from four, six to eight cylinder. Actually, they even have some B10 models. Uh, because they are universal, you have to do some custom fabrication on the brackets uh, that will pertain to that application. So um, here's some of the brackets that we've made um, to mount our different components under the hood. Here's just a few, uh, few components of the system. Uh, real quick, this is a uh, propane vaporizer. You feed in the uh, liquid propane, hook up a couple of heater hoses, warms the propane, vaporizes it, sucks it into the engine. Uh, here's our fuel injector rails that we'll be adding. Uh, here's our ECM for the propane. A couple injection modules. This is a uh, vapor filter. These are a couple other additional little modules that you're going to need to wire in. Uh, and just some miscellaneous hardware, Y adapters for the heater hoses. And uh, here's a, uh, a module that needs to be added in into the fuel pump circuit. And then the wiring harness. This is um, kind of the underhood picture of the 5.0. Before we get started, just so you kind of know what you're looking at before and after. This is a picture of our uh, tank that I've already installed into the bed. Uh, we decided to go with a uh, in-bed tank just for sheer volume. They also make tanks that you can bolt underneath the truck in between the frame rails. And here on the left, you can see uh, with the yellow cap, that is a remote fill uh, assembly that we made. And, install that way you can fill the vehicle right there from uh, behind the, the back of the cab without climbing up into the bed okay just a uh, kind of a follow-up to show you a completed system once it's installed um, kind of an overview you can see over here we mounted the uh, vaporizer this is uh, where your fuel is going to come in heater hoses spliced into, pre-warm the propane to vaporize it and then uh, release it here through the outlet into the, the uh, fuel filter. And then you got two lines that come off of that fuel filter and go to each injector rail. You have one injector rail here that we've mounted and we've got one over here. We use the uh, pre-existing bolt holes for the valve covers and then you drill and tap into the intake on each runner put a little nozzle in and then you run a, a uh, gas line from that nozzle to the corresponding injector pretty simple we've got our, all of our wiring nice and uh, tight up here loomed up taped up everything clean and then you come over here this was uh, a good location to mount our uh, ECM for the propane and also we've got a couple uh, of the injector modules down on the side. So overall we've got a nice clean kind of a uh, factory look to it and uh, looks like it belongs under the hood. <laughs> 